Welcome back. We have Carrie Welch here, makeup artist from Welcome. Fortunate Face Minerals. Thank you. So Thank excited you. to have you on. I'm excited to be here. This yes. is going to be a great segment. We've got a lot of cool stuff planned yes, for this. So. I do. I can't wait. I'm already it's like makeup. You know, I know. Asking questions I want to use behind the scenes, going, "Hey, <laughs> I like this pink one already." I'm like, oh. "Right." Now we were talking offset earlier. This is all your own line. This is my line. Yes. This is incredible. Tell yes. us your a little bit about line, this. Yeah, in the sense I, crea of I created this from scratch, from raw ingredients. I don't did third it yourself. party this. No, I did it myself. So cool. My parents didn't waste my very expensive education in college. <laughs> Good I was them. a science major. <laughs> so even though I work as a makeup artist, which most people are like, Money well, well spent. Doesn't, yeah. doesn't take a science degree. Uh, um, this does. This does. This <laughs> brings me back to my organic chemistry days in college and my organic chem lab. And um, it's a lot of fun. I actually do get to like look at raw ingredients and put them together and make these colors That's but I can fun. I can make the makeup perform like how I want scientist. it to. I've actually been in your manufacturing you have. facility and I you had all the scales out and you have everything set up. Yes. I mean it's really it yes. takes a and lot everything's to do a it. formula. Everything is a mathematical formula. I mean all everything's comes down weighed. To math. Yeah it does yeah. all come down to math. Told that. I don't and do I'm this. not good at math. It all just comes down to math. <laughs> Luckily it's fairly easy math and it's yeah. within certain parameters. And I feel like it's a repeat, right? It is. Once you know it Forget it. Like, yeah. I can half do it in my it's head like a now. Recipe. Now, like we it. have your beautiful daughter, Kayleen, yes. here. Yes. Who already has gorgeous skin. You don't really even need to do anything to this face. <laughs> I'm sure because mom tells you to take care of it. <laughs> we, yes, mom yeah. is on her to take care of her oh, skin. Oh, I'm sure. So, tell us a little bit about what you're going to do here. Well, you guys asked me specifically to talk about mimicking that. that sun-kissed glow. Right. We all without want it without the sun. Right. We all, all want year it. All year round, Correct. people want it. Oh, and you can do it all year round, and you can do it safely. Right. That's the big thing with And inexpensively, because that's always yes. the catch, where some people are like, oh, I want that, but, but I don't want to spend that kind of money. Exactly. Absolutely. So yeah. we want to be able to say you yes. can get what you need in the same healthy format, but it's it's obtainable. Correct. Yeah. It is obtainable. I mean, you're not just laying there. You might actually have to do something, but it's, <laughs> but it's quick. Yes. It's four steps. The very first thing you have to do is your face has to be, you know, you want to cover any redness, you want to cover under eye circles. Okay. So you're going to start with whether you use a BB cream or a, a tinted moisturizer or a mineral foundation or liquid, whatever it is that's going to even out your skin tone. Okay. So you want to start with your clean canvas. Okay. And then it's really three products. And you can see I have the color ranges here. Sure. So this would be the bronzer, the blush, and the highlighter that you would use like deeper skin toned women. These, these would be the more appropriate shades. Okay. This would be like my shade, this skin tone. In fact, these are exactly the products I'm wearing today. Oh, Purposely awesome. put them on to come on the show. Beautiful right. skin. I went to the beach yesterday. I got zero color because I sunscreened yep. up. I <laughs> lathered up. But you look like But I still look glow. like I have yep. that glow because I used these right. products. And that's the thing. It just looks so healthy. Like when you see people who are tanned, yeah, they look you tanned, the but you, it doesn't look healthy. It's yeah. the residual damage, I mean, though. That's the problem. You may look may healthy in the short run do. because you've got that tan yeah. and you look like you've been out in the sun. But what happens is the minute that tan fades, yeah. all of a sudden you start seeing the right. age spots. I have yeah. plenty of age spots. I grew up, you know, I was a teenager in the 80s oh, yeah. when baby laying oil. out with baby oil <laughs> was oh, the yeah. thing. Yep. And I uh -huh. have age spots under here and I have texture to my skin that I wouldn't have if, had I known back then right. what I know sure. now. I we, we all say that. Jeez, if I could rewind exactly. my time, like exactly. Yes. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Yes. <laughs> she is actually. She's pretty good about it. And she has fairer skin anyway. Sure. In fact, these are her colors right in here. And it's so right. crazy because okay. it yes. looks like so pink. Like for me, unknowledgeable. If I go into the store, right. I see that and I'm like, oh, no, I don't want to look like it on her. It looks simple. I know, natural. but it doesn't look like this, that. And that's the thing. For blushes, particularly. It's very deceiving because yes. I'll see these bright colors and be like, oh, I don't want to have like Barbie doll face. Right. But bright yeah. colors, if they're, if they're created into a slightly more sheer base, still allow your skin tone to glow through. Okay. But but brighter colors are also also more youthening to the skin oh, because hmm. they're the colors that appear you're in your skin. start using some bright pink colors yes. now. <laughs> and these are our super fair girls. So this would be like you, Miss Megan. Yes. You would be wearing these colors, okay. like our redheads, our super pale, like our Snow Whites that have yes. the really pale what would skin. My colors be? You would be in this oh, okay. demographic just like me. Okay. Um, so we're going to do this with Kayleen, and Great. first we're going to start with the bronzer. Okay, so I'm going to take a nice fluffy brush, and these are all matte. Matte, okay. This has a teeny bit of gold sheen. The African American women, women of deeper color, can have a teeny sheen to okay. theirs okay. because it, we don't want to flatten their faces either. Sure. So two matte can flatten faces uh, when you're really, really dark. We need to sometimes create a little bit of depth and a little bit of light to their skin. Okay. But everyone else needs 100% matte. Okay. It's the only way to truly mimic 
We don't get Natural. glittery when we have a right, sun, when right, we have right. a suntan. Unless like people who do want to put the glimmers, like if you're going out, well, the highlights. That's, 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 that's our highlight. Like and we're yes. going to get to that because yeah. that again is strategic. Yeah. So the first thing you're going to do, where you're going correct. And what you're doing. Okay. We're going to, we're going to. But gonna, the base of it, no glitter. No glitter. Okay. We're going to load up the brush, and you never want to see big clumps of powder sitting on the brush. I like to work it right into the brush because I get to load a lot on. And bronzer is going to go where the sun naturally hits you first, mm -hmm. which is all the high points of your face. Okay. So obviously we know we get right on the cheekbone first. The temple, the bridge of the nose, and the tip of the chin. Okay. Okay. So I like to start okay, temple, the stuff that cheekbone, out. and I drag a little there. Okay. And we're going to work it in. Same thing. So I do almost like a little bit of a three. I've seen this. And then we do the Z, which is up and right over the bridge of the nose okay. and right over here. Now I'm going to wipe off the brush a little bit here because I want to actually now start blending this in. And you want to blend it back to the hairline. Mm -hmm. Right, Always so back into the hairline. You want no lines of demarcation. Like line. <laughs> no. Or, or the chin. Does it match the your cheek? That is my worst that. nightmare. And honestly, if I find her neck is a little pale, I'm going to actually take it right yeah. down her neck because I want it to match. You don't want that drastic change, yep. right? And right over the bridge of the nose. And you see how already we've already added some pretty yes. color? And this is, you know, you want to It doesn't blend. look like there's a lot on the brush. Uh-uh. No. Very little. It's well pigmented. It's very well pigmented. But that's also how you created it. Correct. I professionally pigmented because I because as professional makeup artists, we have zero patience. Dip back, dip back, dip back sure. 20 times to, like, create an effect. Sometimes. Well, you've got to be fast. I've been at fashion industry. shows where I've had five minutes to do the makeup. Yeah. <laughs> five minutes backstage. Yeah. You know, they're, they don't joke around. So... And you can see we'll get it along the cheekbone, very little on the jawline. We don't want too much. It's this more the chin. This also looks very relaxing. Yeah. I feel like I want to yes. sleep. Does it feel like amazing? It's it so soft. Does. And I'm going to take a nice fluffy brush and just blend it. Okay. keep blending, keep blending. And it seems very soft on the face because of the fact, like my skin is very sensitive, like I had mentioned to you yes. before. We started the show and um i don't like a lot of makeup on yes i don't like it to look like i have a lot this of makeup doesn't on. feel heavy i don't at like all. it to feel no. cakey you know if you're or using... if you sweat you know sometimes you have makeup on and then it'll start clumping and i'm like oh, sure. yeah it's this been won't such do this a, my mission no. has been finding the right um cover up because you know i have such dark circles under my eyes just because i have fair skin and mm -hmm. thin skin around my face and because my skin is sensitive so i feel like amongst I'm sure a lot of you out there, a lot of our viewers have the same issues that I have. Oh, yes. Sensitive skin, you know, thin skin, dark circles. Sure. You know, so it's like to, to come across Especially and now that find. Especially back in session. Oh, yes. Dark circles. Yes. yes. And yes. that's the thing. And I'll Early find something up. in the store, but then it's like, okay, i got to spend $10, $20 to try it. And right. it doesn't work. It's right. too dark. It's not my right shade. Or I have, yeah. you know, allergic reaction to it because I don't know what the heck's in it. Right. So I don't know right. what's giving me the reaction, you know, or it feels too cakey. I mean, it's so frustrating. Just I'm sorry. I'm just so excited to see this pink. You're so excited. It just is so pink. No, I know it's going to look so Could beautiful. Can you explain on her. what's in it? Yes. Like organic, or because I think well, that would be organic in the sense that most people think of organic is organically grown. So that's okay. a farming method. Right. Yes, it's organic. Talking about yeah, that. I know. Yeah. Here's the science. Um, yes, it's organic because it's carbon based. But we're okay. all carbon based. You and I are organic. Right. So I mean, yes, it yes, is organic, organic based. <laughs> yes, but it's <laughs> more than it's others. mineral based. So this is okay. these are made of minerals, um, iron oxide, zinc oxide, titanium dioxide. Okay. Um, I also use ultramarine blue, which is a blue shade to tone with. And then there's also micas and okay. everything from muscovite mica, which is a matte mica that's mined in Moscow, Russia, all the way to some sparkly ones, which look great in eyeshadows. Sure. And you can also put them in lip products and they look great sparkly lip products. 